The truest thing that I've ever documented. Okay, I'm gonna go. I don't really like this hem thing. Uh. Oh shit.
This might take a second, so you can't hear me. You're like, yeah, you're like the guys the fire has <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. I have the rest of it ready. I don't know why I was saying this. Instead of grapes, she's going to say spring cake cheese. Oh, lovely. Wait, oh, there's no logo on it. Oh, I love you. Oh, to goodness. Oh, I love you. You're pie. Okay, sorry. Well, I got an orchard cake. No. The India. Oh, remember the old makeup tutorial? Yeah. And it was literally, I go, this is literally my waking nightmare. It was horrible, the cartoon. Ready, guys? Yeah. Hey, guys. Is the CEO. Welcome to the finance department. Thank you. Mm. To the boost morale nice. in the finance department, the CEO. Now they don't taste as good because I'm under pressure. It's not so good. Mm, yummy. No, they're yummy. They have dairy in them though. Oh, they're really yummy. Mm. Where are your brownies? Mm -hmm. You can't see anything. So basically, um, the other night, basically, I got spiked and I don't want to talk about it. And I also do not want sympathy because it's actually too embarrassing to get sympathy. But basically, I got spiked and I just don't want to talk about it because basically I just blacked out, but it's fine. Um, and it was just really scary, and, but it's okay because I, w well, I was really depressed and then I just like... Now I feel okay, but I was really depressed. Um, <clears throat> because I feel really like scared. I feel like, um, I'm. Sometimes I can just take things too far, where I'm just like, it's obviously not my fault, but I just feel like it is my fault because I just like take it too far or something. I don't know, but basically, I um usually go through these phases of life where I'm calm and peaceful, and then I'm like. You know, I can be calm and peaceful and it can be boring and dull and or I can be electric and exciting, which can be um, blinding or um, or terrifying. Um, and I think that because I haven't slept properly in like uh, ages, like a really long time because I um, I'm going out all the time or I'm just like too anxious because I'm just on. And I'm doing loads of things all the time and I'm not like you know even doing my routine that much anymore so I think I need to start doing that because that really grounds me but I feel that I'm not like sad anymore and I don't think I will be for a long time because I think that the secret is your philosophy on life and I think that my philosophy on life is like a really positive one that I can that grinds me every time so I think that's like the secret to everything and when you get like lost and you take things too far or it goes too far or like whatever that you come home to God or like come home to yourself and coming home to myself is obviously coming home to God and like when I feel low I can just be low and when I feel high I can be high um but too much of either makes you sick you know um and if you get caught in either it makes you sick so, yeah, um, and I think that I hadn't made a YouTube video in so long because I was in that phase. I, I, I've, I've, I've talked about this before, but there's like phases of um, dreaming and then you're living your dreams. And I think I was in the phase where I was living my dreams. So I was like too caught up in that where I wasn't dreaming. And I think when I'm, I make the best art when I'm like in my dreaming stage where I'm like, you know, planning and making things and staying home and being by myself. Um, but I actually, like, um, but then, it's you know, there's good things to both, but it just wasn't the buzz to, like, make a video, and I didn't really know what to say. And I felt like there was no point, because I was like, what's... Because 
where I always want to be true with my R's. And to be true, you have to ask yourself every time you're making something, unless it just like comes out of you, every time you're making something like, why am I doing this? And sometimes you don't really need to ask yourself why, but I mean, like I was like, why am I making this video? What's this video for? And it, it, I couldn't find a purpose for it. So um, you don't need to have words as an answer, but I just mean like an energetic knowing. Um, I don't know why I was like, I haven't been making anything. I've been focusing on writing recently. I've been writing loads. Um, I'm hoping to be making a like poetry and prose like book, I guess. Uh, I don't know why I said it like this. I really want to write a book also. I'll read you guys this. <clears throat> The air is full of fog and the night catches up to us. The moon is thick and drooping. None of us can see straight. But as the fog bends, I see you there, disheveled and all. And I want to pick you up and make you all better. I never let myself, though, because for me, you stand there between the fog. And for you, I am only another body that disappears into it. I do not suffer, though. I drink my wine and laugh because we are only fools in this fog. But tomorrow, when it is all gone and we finally escape each other, I will still remember your face even though you will forget mine. And that is okay, because I am a fool when it's raining too, and when the sun shines it binds me. As long as there is you, I will always be a fool. If I could paint, for you I would. If I could sing, for you I would. If I could dance, for you I would. If I could love, for you, for you I would.